You want to see something with six? Sure. Here we go. What the fuck is going on over there? Stand by. How's it going, dude? Doing good. Awesome. Doing good. Cool. Yeah. Like those headphones, buddy. Yeah, definitely. You wanna, you wanna use them? Yeah, no, I won't use them. I want them. Uh, no. Give it to me. Oh, oh, cool. Ah. Cool. Ah. Cool. Ah. Terrible acting. Ah. <laughs> Look at that classic acting right there. It's great. What is gonna happen once you get back with him again? What do you, you know? What's the next step? So out here traveling out here in the Midwest, um, just kind of fulfilling some of the duties that we have uh, assigned to us. Uh, when I, I'm obviously not there, um, but you know, service is being taken care of all by one of my trainers, Eric, and then our kennel manager, uh, Rochelle. So uh, when I do get back, we're going to go more, work more of the fundamentals. Of the a lot of is, you know, prey drive, trying to harness a lot of that. But at this moment, you know, it's just, it's just all fun. So we're just going to have as much fun with it as possible. Um, you know, starting, you know, or starting and maintaining his management so he doesn't get unruly and crazy, uh, like our Dutch Shepherds over there. Um, but yeah, it's just going to be kind of the whole, the whole fun process of building the fundamentals, establishing the bond, you know, finding his motivations, working with him, and make sure he's having a great time. Um, yeah, I should be back uh, early next week and get cracking on that. So, <laughs> I just got back into the bay last night. Had to travel, fulfill some of our contracts. Uh, so I've been gone for about 10 days. Uh, prior to that, I got service, I want to say three or four days before I had to leave. So I didn't, really didn't get to do too much with them, just kind of playing and trying to establish some bond. Uh, so now what we're going to start doing now that I have time, or now that I'm here, <clears throat> is we're going to work on some of his fundamentals. I know he had already gotten some fundamental work with his narcotics, uh, which I believe was PCP and cocaine and marijuana uh, through deployment logistics. So we're going to kind of work with this hunt a little bit. <laughs> I'm just getting him, you know, biting some stuff and, you know, start working and getting some marking in. Building a lot more just fundamental work with them and obviously have fun with them as a puppy. And from what I've seen, or from what I've heard from some of the videos while I was gone, he was, he was raising a little bit of, raising a little bit of hell, well, biting everybody. But yeah, looking forward to actually be able to spend time with my puppy, so, and integrate him into my pack. I really haven't had the opportunity to see Cerberus because he was with one of my trainers, Eric. Uh, who was babysitting him, so this will be like the first time I'm gonna see him since I left uh, about 10, like 10, 11 days. Oh God, and he has feet and stuff. <laughs> what is that? Can we play tea party while you're gone? Oh my God. Just wait till you see his sailor outfit. Yeah. I, Don't you love it? I, this is horrible. What is this? What? <laughs> what? <laughs> what is that, a, a vest hoodie? It's the latest thing all the kids are wearing. Oh. A vest hoodie. This is ridiculous. We got bigger, that's for sure. A lot of this is just play and like showing like the hunt or the you know the prey play drive. So just building the drive for the the actual <coughs> item, and then one a couple of things too is what we'll do is we'll start just rewarding them for regripping or, or gripping full. So if you see, I'll make a miss, make a miss, just build it up a little bit. <coughs> And they let him get it, and it's easy. Bite shallow. Good boy. And he full grips again. Good boy. He regrips the full. Let him have it. So he just starts to build association early. That you know, full calm grips. He doesn't really have a calm grip right now, but are what we want. Big digging grips.